Fortunately, the more likely end of our universe is something called a heat death. And the reason I use a snowflake as the uh, emoji for this one is that a heat death is actually a very cold kind of ending. Um, the term heat there refers to sort of disordered energy. Uh, it refers to how um, entropy is, is moving through the universe. But it's not a hot death. It's a really very cold one, it's sometimes called the big freeze. And it takes a really long time. So the idea behind the heat death is, you know, what if the universe just keeps expanding? And the reason that we think that this is more likely at this point is because uh, in the 1990s, astronomers were trying to figure out, you know, is the universe going to keep expanding forever or is it going to collapse? And so they went ahead and measured it and they found out that it was a negative number. They found out that the universe was not decelerating at all, that the universe was actually speeding up, which is about as weird as if I take this and I throw it up into the air and it slows down for a little bit and then just shoots off into space.